Hello everybody! So in today's video I'm going to show you how you can connect these two guys here, the PlayStation 5 controller and a PlayStation 4 controller, how you actually can connect to the your iPad. And it's pretty simple, I've been playing a game now called Farming Simulator 23 for a couple of hours with just using the control on the iPad and... Yeah, with my clumsy fat thumbs, uh, that's no no good. So I've I've tried this out and it's working. It is easy, PC. Even I can do it, and I'm almost fifty. So I'm gonna show you how you can do it. So here we are. We got our iPad screened to my uh, PC screen and how to do that you can just see down below uh, how you can mirror your iPad like so boop, onto your PC screen uh, but anyway <laughs> first thing we need to do is to activate the Bluetooth on your iPad so then you go into the settings and then all the way on the top almost it's called Bluetooth and you need to turn that on like so so now it's gonna, there we go, it's gonna search for uh, different Bluetooth devices. Now I haven't activated the one I'm gonna use now. So I'm gonna go back here again. And this is, um, well, it's not straightforward, but I'm gonna put up uh, probably a screen here now on how to do it. So you need to press the PlayStation button and the small one on the top left there uh, you can see it up here uh, and you need to hold them in uh, until the controller starts to blink or flash like so there we go come on buddy there we go it's really difficult to see uh, but it's flashing blue now so if I go in here now and I deselect no I have to do it on the iPad <laughs> <laughs> there we go uh, let's see if we can find anything uh, so it should be should be the dual sense wire controller shouldn't he so I just click on that one boop and there we go it's connected so now we can go out from here and I'm gonna fire up the game I think uh, where is it there we go farming simulator 23 There we go, let's see now. Oh yeah, it's working! So I can go up and down and I'm gonna just uh, start my let's play here. He says, how do I do this? Back, continue. Oh, you know, nice. Uh, there we go. Um, one thing to note, Though, especially on this game, Farming Simulator 23, it seems like it's registering this PlayStation controller as an Xbox controller because it's referring to the A, B, and C things, um, which we don't have on. Um, there we go. Let's see here now. And we have. No sound. So there we go. I finally got some sound here. Uh, but as you can see now, I'm using this little fellow here uh, to move around. And it's so much easier. And even, you know, with holding down R2, I can even run. So it's so much easier. And switching between vehicles is just the left and right on the pad. Do, 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 like so. Super easy. Uh, I can zoom in and out. Wow, this is so much better than <laughs> using the iPad. Hiring a worker. Now here we can see. Let's see. Yeah, there. So that's hiring worker. And it says B. And we don't have any B on the PlayStation controller. But that's the same as uh, O. Or circle. So if I press circle now. And I can jump out. We got a worker. Going over to this, uh, if I want to disconnect, let's see, yeah, so that that's the same uh, with X. Now a really cool thing about FS23 is, 
um, you see this header here is connected to a trailer. But once you just drive over to the header, look what happened with the trailer. Boop! It automatically co uh, connects and <laughs> the header trailer is gone. Um, menu, boom, like so. Uh, out again. Uh, sh um, settings, easy PC, minimap. No, not that one. Uh, how did I do that? Minimap, LB. Well, that's same as L1. So then you get the minimap up, like so. L1. So I, 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 I've actually tried to see if there are any settings, uh, you know, so I can, uh, what should I say, go over to, um, to PlayStation controller, but that doesn't seem to work, actually. Uh, but it's more or less the same uh, controls as you have on uh, your PlayStation. Now, the only thing I haven't, I haven't found out there is to manually save the game. Uh, it seems like it is like uh, if you have an automatic save um, every 15 minutes. So, yeah. There we go. I'm looking at three different screens now. I have the play screen, I have the OBS screen, and I have this one. So yeah, I'm a little bit confused. Um, <laughs> but anyway, so now uh, we're gonna try to do the same with this guy. The old style PlayStation 4 one. So, same thing here with activating the uh, Bluetooth. Uh, PlayStation button and the small one on top, so I should just press these guys like so. And there we go, and you can barely see it blinking, but it's blinking. So now we need to jump back to this one, and now you see that I have something called... Do we have the mouse there? Yeah. Uh, DualShock 4 wireless controller, so I'm gonna boop, connect to that one now. Oh, both of them are connected now. Oh, shoot. Uh, let's say the PlayStation 5 one. Can I... Okay, disconnect. <laughs> okay, so now we only have the dual uh, shock PlayStation 4 controller connected. Uh, so I'm going to fire up the game again. And uh, let's see if this old one here works now. Let's see. Oh, yeah. There we go. Uh, how did I activate it now? Nine, 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 nine. What is A? But um, yeah, it's working. It's working like a charm. Uh, both with the PlayStation 4 and with the PlayStation 5 controller. It's really easy to connect to your um, iPad. And I haven't downloaded the game on my PlayStation, no, my iPhone yet, but I assume it's exactly the same on your iPhone. So if we jump here now, uh, oh, we have some new icon. Ah, oh, look at this. Ooh, look at this. I don't know if you noticed, but look at this. Here you have X, O, and X circle and square. Let's move to the harvester. Yeah! R1 and circle. Start the one. How do you like the game? Uh, I'm gonna do four. Oh, I do. I need to do it on the iPad. <laughs> Yeah, so uh, obviously on the PlayStation 4 controller, minimap L1. Oh, that's strange. With this fancy $80 uh, PlayStation 5 controller, you're getting wrong input. With this old one, let me just, uh, this one here, the PlayStation 4 controller. 
This exact one is uh, 2011. This is 12 years old. <laughs> it's older than my oldest kid. Oh, the trailer also directly connects. Okay, so let's see now. I'm just driving backward. And it connects directly. How about the cedar? Let's disconnect that one. Oh, oh man. Did you see the weight? Where did my weight go? <laughs> okay, now I'm just driving backwards. The, oh, the weight and... Let's disconnect. I know I'm not showing this, but... The weight disappears. Drive a little bit forward. And then backwards. And... <laughs> Alright. Uh, so that's how you connect your um, PlayStation controllers. And I have to say, this old fellow here is probably the better one. Um, I think I have three or four of these. This is probably not the best one. Uh, but it works also with this one. You're only getting wrong... With these guys, you know, the uh, A, B, and C's, and circles, and triangles. But anyway, that was another short, sweet, and simple. How to connect the PlayStation 4 and 5 controller to your iPad. Mm -hmm.